Hi everyone, my name is Molly Vanko. And I'm Shannon Garvey. So we wanted to take this time today during this virtual assembly to give you a little background information on the two mascot finalists that we have decided on. The speech and debate team has volunteered to talk on behalf of our two mascot finalists. So let's um, hand it over to our first uh, member of the speech and debate team, Arya Zucci. Seems like you got two choices to me. Kindly step aside. Or get run over. Give it up for your Unionville Stampede! A stampede, no matter what the specific type of animal, is a group of animals that are charging forward together. Our mascot would specifically be a thoroughbred horse. Pennsylvania, specifically Chester County, is rich in history relating to the racehorse. Specifically in southern Chester County, learning the ways of a horse is a family affair with skills that are honed and treasured for generations. Unionville has rich history dating back numerous years with a hilly, field-like terrain allowing for horses to thrive. To this, I tell you that we are both honoring the people in this area who have worked with horses for years, but are also honoring the area in which we live that is full of horses. Thoroughbred horses are known as racehorses, which are a highly respected and valued type of horse. To have this as our mascot would show that our standards are high, as these horses are intelligent, athletic, spirited, and bold, essentially exemplifying the traits we see at our students at the Unionville High School. Specifically with our school, the U has been a crucial part of our logo for many years, and I think a lot of people want to keep that. How will we be able to integrate it into our new like mascot, new logo, if we do the stampede? Specifically in regards to a thoroughbred horse, they wear horseshoes because they race a lot and this horseshoe kind of symbolizes a U so we can still keep that U as a big part of our school pride and culture. So let's turn it over to our next member of the speech and debate team, Ibrahim Qureshi, and he'll present on our next mascot finalist. You better steer clear, and that's no bull. Give it up for your Unionville Longhorn! The Longhorn, if you're unfamiliar, is a breed of cattle which is known for its unique set of horns, which are big and pointed. In fact, these special horns help the Longhorn meet mascot guiding principle number five. We can form the U in Unionville with the horns, translating to attractive and identifiable branding for the school. The Longhorn has deep historical roots in our area. In the 1940s, the famous King Ranch from Texas had a problem. Droughts in the West had decreased the quality of grazing land available for cattle. To solve this problem, the King Ranch bought the Buck and Doe Run Valley Farms in the Unionville area and transformed them into the Working Cattle Farm. Longhorn and other cattle were shipped here by rail from Texas. Even until the 1980s, Longhorn cattle were still seen on the farmland. Today, you can drive not only 10 minutes from the high school and see a group of Longhorns near Northbrook. How does the Longhorn represent an entire student body? And what positive qualities does the Longhorn, does the Longhorn confer? The name Longhorn, unlike other mascots such as the bull, is a gender neutral term, which means we can have a more inclusive mascot for a whole student body. Plus, the Longhorn is a strong and tough animal, representing the fortitude and strength of us here at Unionville. We have two great options. The Longhorns and Stampede are some of the best mascot options yeah. around. This yeah. has been a really long and thorough process, but it's been so much fun to help decide mm -hmm. what the next mascot is. Thank you guys for joining us today at this virtual assembly, and I hope you guys um, have fun on deciding what our next mascot is. Go in your will.